One of the enduring mysteries of Frankie Beverly's personal life has been the identity of Anthony's mother. Frankie himself was very private about this aspect of his life, but in recent years, Anthony has shed light on his mother, Wanda Forrest, who chose to live a life away from the limelight. Despite her preference for privacy, Wanda Forrest's influence on both Frankie and Anthony Beverly has been profound. Her role as a mother and supportive partner provided a stable foundation for her family, even as she remained out of the public eye. While Frankie was making waves in the music world, Wanda was quietly supporting their son, helping to raise him and instill values of love and family. Although she preferred a life of privacy, Wanda's role in the Beverly family dynamic cannot be understated. Anthony frequently honors her on social media, showing the deep bond they share. Wanda currently lives with her son in California, and their close-knit relationship continues to be a source of love and support for both of them. Though she stayed away from the celebrity glare, Wanda's influence on the Beverly family speaks to the importance of family even in the midst of fame. Throughout his life, one of the most enduring relationships Frankie Beverly had was with Pam Moore, a former television journalist. Although they never married, their relationship was built on love, trust, and mutual respect. Moore has been a steady presence in Beverly's life, sharing in his successes and supporting him through his struggles. Pam Moore is a respected journalist, best known for her work as an anchor at Crone TV in San Francisco. Despite her own busy career, she stood by Frankie for decades, becoming an integral part of his personal life. Their bond was strong, and while they kept much of their relationship private, it was clear that Moore played an important role in Beverly's life. In many ways, Pam Moore's quiet presence alongside Frankie reflected his desire for a life lived on his own terms. While the couple chose not to marry, they maintained a deep and meaningful connection that mirrored Frankie's relationship with music authentic, passionate, and filled with love. For those close to Frankie, Pam was recognized as his partner in every sense of the word, standing by his side through the ups and downs of his career. The heart of Frankie Beverly's life was love in all its forms. Whether it was the love he poured into his music, his love for his family, or the love he shared with Pam Moore, it was love that defined him. Even as his career took him around the world, Frankie remained grounded, always making sure to maintain close relationships with those he cared about. The mystery surrounding Frankie's personal life, particularly his relationship with Wanda Forrest, only adds another layer to the complexity of his story. While he may have chosen not to conform to traditional family structures, the love he shared with his son, grandchildren, and partner spoke volumes about the depth of his heart. Frankie Beverly's life was a testament to following one's passion and staying true to oneself. He never felt the need to conform to societal expectations but instead chose to create a life filled with meaning and purpose, grounded in music and love. As fans remember Frankie Beverly, they will celebrate not only the music that touched their lives but also the man who lived authentically, with a heart full of love. Through his son Anthony, his partner Pam Moore, and his music, Frankie's legacy will continue to inspire future generations. Frankie Beverly, the soulful frontman of Mays, touched countless lives with his music, leaving behind an indelible mark on the world of R&B, soul, and funk. But beyond the stage and the iconic anthems, Beverly's life was defined by his deep love for music and the family he cherished. This article explores the many dimensions of his legacy, from his career as an artist to his role as a father, grandfather, and partner to the lesser-known parts of his life. Frankie Beverly's rise to fame began in the 1970s with Mays, a band known for creating soulful, powerful music that resonated with fans around the globe. Hits like Before I Let Go and Joy and Pain became timeless anthems showcasing his unique ability to craft music filled with vulnerability, passion, and raw honesty. Beverly's love for music ran deeper than any other aspect of his life, shaping his path and priorities. Throughout his career, Beverly dedicated himself to his craft with unwavering passion. Music was not just a career or a hobby for him, it was a calling that required sacrifice. Though he never married, his decision to stay single was not a reflection of an inability to love. Instead, it was a choice driven by his desire to pour everything into his music. For Frankie, music was the truest form of expression and connection. His songs offered emotional honesty, often channeling the very feelings that people search for in relationships. By choosing music over marriage, he found a way to share his deepest emotions with millions of fans, building a legacy that would transcend time. 
While Beverly's legacy is firmly rooted in his musical contributions, his family held an equally significant place in his heart. He was a devoted father to his son, Anthony Beverly, and a proud grandfather to his three grandchildren, including Tia and Ava. Though his family life often took a back seat to his music in the public eye, Frankie found immense joy in his roles as a father and grandfather. Anthony Beverly, Frankie's son, followed in his father's footsteps, becoming a musician and joining Mays as a drummer. Their father-son bond was unique, filled with mutual admiration and respect. Frankie often beamed with pride when talking about Anthony's success, recognizing the special connection they shared through music. Anthony, too, has spoken highly of his father, citing Frankie as his greatest mentor and teacher. Growing up around music, Anthony embraced his calling from an early age, performing alongside his father on stage and later carving out his own career in the music industry. Today, Anthony works as a producer and director of Andar at Brenta Music Group Incorporated, continuing the Beverly legacy with a deep love and passion for music, much like his father. Despite their success, Mays and Frankie Beverly faced their share of challenges. The music industry was notorious for exploiting artists, and like many of his contemporaries, Beverly had to navigate complicated business dealings. However, he remained focused on his music and maintained creative control over his work, ensuring that Mays's sound remained authentic. Mays never received the same level of mainstream recognition as some of their peers, but for Frankie Beverly, commercial success was never the goal. He valued longevity, integrity, and connection with his audience above all else. One of the key elements that made Frankie Beverly and Mays resonate with listeners was the emotional authenticity in their songs. Tracks like Joy and Pain captured the duality of life how happiness and sadness are intertwined. The song became a cultural anthem, often played at weddings, cookouts, and even funerals, spoke to the human experience, reminding listeners that life's trials and triumphs are inseparable. Throughout his career, Frankie Beverly made personal sacrifices in the name of his music. Unlike many of his contemporaries, Beverly never married, choosing instead to dedicate himself fully to his craft. His decision to remain single allowed him to pour all his energy into his music, but it also led to misconceptions about his personal life. For Beverly, music was the love of his life. He often spoke about how his songs reflected the emotions and experiences that others might find in relationships. In a sense, Beverly found his fulfillment through his music, and it became his primary vehicle for expressing love and vulnerability. While Frankie Beverly may have chosen not to marry, his role as a father was a significant part of his life. His son Anthony Beverly grew up immersed in music, following in his father's footsteps to become a musician. Anthony joined Mays as a drummer, performing alongside his father and learning the ropes of the music industry from an early age. Frankie and Anthony shared a unique father-son bond, built on mutual respect and admiration. Anthony often credits his father as his greatest teacher, not just in music but in life. Today Anthony continues to carry the Beverly legacy forward as a producer and director of A&R at Brenta Music Group Incorporation. In the end Frankie Beverly was more than just a musician he was a father, a partner, a lover of music, and a man who lived life on his own terms. His legacy, both on and off the stage, will remain a powerful reminder of the impact one can make by staying true to oneself. I hope you liked the video, don't forget to like share and subscribe. Any thoughts? Share in the comments and thanks for watching.